everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, we're going to take a look at just a wicked cool 1972 Chevrolet K5 Blazer CST killer little two-wheel drive lower down truck, guys. Love this thing, man. I've driven it multiple times now. Um, these things are just super cool. You just don't see them. Uh, normally, to be honest with you, I hate them with the top on them. Uh, we've got a big K5 that's lifted up, and I, I refuse to even put the top on it. But uh, with this little two-tone color combination, it actually really looks good. But I'll be honest with you, if I took this thing home, I'd take that top off, uh, stick it up in my rafters, and never put it on because they are super cool with the tops off. 20-inch uh, American racing wheels all the way around it. ZR rated rubber. Killer, killer color combination. Tuxedo black and white. Of course, it's got the white fully removable top. And then it's got all new red vinyl interior. So you know uh, this, this thing screams my name. This is one of my favorite color combinations. Uh, Georgia truck. Good, solid, straight body. Uh, you can see the grill here is actually original. Uh, but it's a recent body up restoration. They've upgraded the headlights. Um, not a whole lot like paint wise. You're not going to really pick at it. It's, in, it's really nice. Um, bumpers, couple little marks on them as you kind of walk around, but really nice truck, guys. Well, it's already gotten dusty out here. It's gorgeous day. We're knocking out the fourth video of the day. This might be a record for me, but... Uh, it is a neat, neat truck. Love that red interior. Top's in really good shape, too. Normally, you can kind of just nitpick the heck out of these tops. Because, like you say, most people take them off and, you know, they get moved around the garage and stuff like that and beat up. This one's pretty dog, uh, doggone nice. The, the glass is nice and clear. The rear glass has got a couple of marks in it I've seen. And this, it's all functional. I took a photo. We'll try to, I, I think I'll, I'll Nathan be able, I think he can, if he's ever opened one of these, but I'll try to have him open it up here when we're going around and doing the video. It's got, uh, what's it called? Mag Magoffee's uh, suspension on it, lowering kit. Love the wheels and tires on it. They look great. truck really sits good goes down the road real good it's nice and tight um, <laughs> it doesn't bang all around killer set of wheels <coughs> front disc brakes dual chrome mirrors Good sound in 350 Chevy small block, Edelbrock aluminum intake, um, I'm sorry, Edelbrock four barrel, it's got a polished aluminum intake. They've ceramic coated the um, ram's horn exhaust manifolds. You can see it's got billet pulleys on it. Um, uh, HEI distributor, power steering, power disc brakes, it's got a 400 turbo hydromatic trans. Aluminum radiator with dual electric fans. The only thing I could see really doing in here is maybe adding air if you wanted air, but like I say, I'd have the top off, so I would not be concerned about that. Pink slick. It's gotten dusty quick, I'll tell you that. Dual chrome mirrors. Looks like new door handles. Door seams are nice and clean. This is all new red interior. New carpet, new sill plates.
bucket seat, center console. It's got the uh, tilt column with a sports steering wheel. Sixty-six nine seventy. That's supposed to be the right miles on the truck. Gauges are nice and clean. It's got a retro sounds radio. Dash pads nice. Um, it's got a plug-in for that radio, and then they've got the aftermarket kick pads for the uh, speakers too. Um, like I said, four hundred turbo dramatic trans. It's got a. Um, I think I can do this. You didn't do it. Let me see if I can do this. Yep, I can. One hand it. This will be the toughest part. Doing this. Yeah. Um. 12 bolt rear end, no big gear, anything like that. Stock rear end, really. This is all real clean in here. And like I say, they're just a blast when you. Uh, It's got spring, uh, the hinges are not spring, they're uh, gas shocks on it. Clean underneath. I shut this thing up. Nope, nope, I got it. Thought I shut it off for a second there, guys. Sorry. Door seams are clean. These things are just so much fun. And you like to say, you drive it down the road, man, and everybody just starts giving you the thumbs up. So much fun to drive. It's another one of those vehicles, man, I'm half tempted to keep, man. The dash is painted nice, and the gauges are nice and clean. This just be a fun, fun truck to cruise. And again, it drives down the road real good. Even though it's lowered, it's not banging and clanging. The truck runs out real good. It's got the uh, serpentine pulley system in it. Everything opens and closes real nice. That's a fun truck right there. Gauges were all working. You can see that with the sun, it's hard to see. It's holding good old pressure. Fuel gauge works, temp gauge works, battery gauge works. Everything opens and closes nice. Master Duels, they sound real good. And I just picked the radio up. works, blower motor works. There's again one of those little plug-ins under the dash for the um look how dusty that thing got already, man. You can see it's got the updated headlights. Again, guys, make sure you keep track of our uh, inventory. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another great way to keep in touch with us is through our Instagram and our Facebook page. Definitely subscribe to our YouTube page. You can do that by clicking the little button there at the bottom. That way you get a notification every time we post a new video.